Hi, this is Prophetess Afia Sabrina Acapo with Crown of Glory Healing and Deliverance Ministries. And I am back again. Um, I have been diligently in prayer today as in every day. And I definitely pray fervently for my YouTube subscribers um, because it means the world to me. Um, prayer is the key that unlocks the door to the kingdom and yes you can go and pray in secret but god also wants that secret place for you to speak to him intimately with just you and him alone um, to manifest some things into the atmosphere so know that prayer is powerful that prayer is um, very important and you should definitely pray without ceasing i just had to let someone know um, just how important it is and stay committed to it stay consistent with it um, never cease from prayer because prayer is the very thing that changes things and include in your prayer the keys which is the word of God because this is where your new dimensions are going to come from. This is where your elevations are going to come from. Even with you praying for others, um, such as your children, such as your family, it is just very um, critical that you stay in consistent prayer, stay in um, constant prayer, um, stay praying fervently, um, stay praying committedly, um, I just cannot stress that enough, how very important and how very significant it is to pray without ceasing. Include his word. Tell God specifically about the things that you're going through. He longs for that prayer time with you. He longs for that secret place in prayer with you so you guys can commune together because he is your best friend he is your everything a covenant a everything covenant with him as well as a blood covenant with him it's everything prayer is everything prayer changes everything prayer produces that shift that you need prayer causes those elevations that you need i cannot even stress that enough Constantly, you guys, stay in prayer because it will uplift your life. It will change your life. I'm a living witness. It will bring you out of bondage. It will bring you out of oppression. It will bring you out of the chains and the enslavements. It will... I cannot stress it enough. I just had to get on here because I felt like somebody definitely needed to know this. Yes, you can. Once again, you can pray silently. He does answer his prayer silently. But when you have responsibility and know that it is just not about you, but it is about others because others are going through, even with the things that you have gone through or are going through, prayer is going to be that key in your word meditating on that word is going to be your key and when you pray include that word in because it is your keys that's un going to unlock the door and anything that's going to be done is going to be done spiritually so you want to definitely make sure you're praying um in the spirit as well and allow the holy spirit to lead you you know you don't have to worry about what to say because the holy spirit will unction you so just wanted to give somebody a little heart to heart you guys on just stressing the importance of prayer and the significance of prayer and that prayer changes things and once again jesus longs for that relationship where you can pray without ceasing where you can pray uh fervently you know and wholeheartedly uh towards him you know he hears you he hears every word um that you are saying and 
it produces an activation in the atmosphere as well. So just wanted to give that brace of nafsis um, on prayer and the importance of how it will take you higher dimensionally and how it is your keys and how it produces that activation in the atmosphere. Pray that you guys are having a fantastic Friday. God bless you. Thank you once again to all of my new subscribers. If you have not subscribed, what are you guys waiting for? This is a family where you can get your peace, your joy, your enrichment, your encouragement, your love, all those good things, along with prayer is the key that unlocks the door to the kingdom. I love you guys. God bless you. Take care until the next video. Bye-bye.